on the Pokemon Showdown ladder, server, whatever you want to call it. I always screw this part up anyways. Anyways, but we got a team, and Gilga Vi Vikingsley, I think his name is? Gilga Vikingsley? Uh, he actually did subscribe to my channel. Big shout out to him. But he passed me this team. It actually puts in a lot of work. I really liked it. Um, and I was like, wow, that looks really familiar. Like, oh, that's such a normal team. And he's like... No, 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 it was original, and uh, I just looking at the team, I really like the fact that you can hazard stack. Um, I, I talked to him about maybe trading out Ferrothorn for maybe Latios, but obviously uh, the team is built around a Mega Metacham, uh, gets fake out Bullet Punch. It's adamant, 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 adamant. I'm adamant about going with adamant. It is so strong when you just, <laughs> you knock out, this, this two hit KO is a fully defensive Skarmory. <laughs> I mean, come on. Uh, smooth Rock, Hip Out On, you really want to abuse the ability of Sand Rush. It was banned in the last generation for a reason. Um, and then you have Tornadus with Assault Vest, uh, just pretty standard set. Um, he actually only runs 216 speed, just out speed. Um, 363. Oh, I can't remember who that is for, off the top of my head for the moment. But uh, And then they also had a Manaphy. I, this is one thing I did change. He was running Scald and Ice Beam. And rain dance which is nice because that gives him a switch into scald just in case you do pick up the burn you can use hydration the ability it's it's a pretty good ability but if I found that energy ball was just giving me better coverage uh, hits Rotom uh, Rotom is a big issue to this team uh, as you can see like really the only thing you have for it is Metacham so that gives me some uh, coverage with Rotom and then Ferrothorn obviously um, it's a mixed defensive set I really like the fact that he runs power whip too um, because power-up is one of my favorite moves. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and pause the recording as we look for a, a battle. So we did get a game here. It's against Spartan3644. Um, actually, I'm going to go ahead and check my ranking. It's not its not terribly great, but let me just look. Yeah, it's at 1438, so um, there's a lot of losses. I'm not even... Well, who cares? I'll show you. 46 losses. That's... I mean, honestly, I did a lot of forfeiting. I did a lot of rage quitting over the break. Um, but just looking at his team, this looks pretty darn standard. Uh, probably Rocky Helmet Chomp, and that's probably what he's going to lead with. So I'm going to lead with my Mana Fee. Uh, it gives me the best matchup. I do get the Head Chomp. Uh, I'm just going straight for the Ice Beam. I don't have a reason to go for anything else. Um, this should KO because this is a modest Mana Fee. I'm pretty sure this KOs, even if it's Defensive Chomp. So we don't necessarily need to go for a Tail Glow right off the bat. He does have a Magnus Zone, so we got to be careful with our Ferrothorn. It does kill, and that's awesome. <laughs> that is one huge threat out of the way. Mega Metacham is just going to start going ham on this guy's team. Um, especially if I can get in before the Metagross, Metagross Mega Evolves. Why can't I speak? Uh, but now he goes into the Mag Zone. I have Hapaladon, and this thing does have Spit F. It has actually pretty good Spit F, too. I'm just going to go straight into it. Yeah, we're gonna go straight into the pout on, get up the sand, and put a little pressure on him. Um, I'm imagining just a volt switch. He probably doesn't think I'm gonna go into a pout on right away. He's probably, well, he might just go for the flash cannon. It doesn't really matter what he goes for here, because we do have counters. Um, if he goes for the flash cannon, then we can just double out into our Ferrothorn and maybe get up a hazard, which would be nice in this scenario. Uh, he actually pulls the double into his Keldeo. Um, probably a good duddle, double, to be honest. And, I mean, this is the biggest problem to our team, Keldeo. Uh, because once we get burnt with something, it just, it just goes downhill. Um, but we can't go into Tornadus. That, I think this is, this is okay here. As he does go straight for the Scald, what is he, yeah, he does get the burn first turn one. Um, but I don't think he's going to stay in here. Either way, I can just U-turn out. That looked like Specs damage, 34%. Yeah, that's probably Specs, because this is obviously a Salt Vested Tornadus. I'm just going to U-turn out of here. If he stays in, then I can go into the Ferrothorn, or maybe even the Manaphy, um, but uh, that's one of the reasons why he had Rain Dance on the Mana Fee was for that hydration ability. I could just, you know, Rain Dance and, you know, <laughs> take the Scald. Uh, he goes into the Magnus Zone actually here. And doesn't that just give us a free kill? Yeah, I believe it does. Um, does he make the aggressive play into his Latios? I think we can't make that prediction here. We're just going to Earthquake. Yes, we got the Earthquake, right. Um, I really thought that he might go into his Latios in that scenario, but it, it didn't make sense to go for the Iron Head because that'd be a really bad play. Um, honestly, Excadrill could have taken a Psyshock or Draco Meteor or whatever uh, and at least 
you know, done a huge amount of damage to Latios. We would have been a little bit behind in that regards. Uh, but we also have the Tornadoes we could have gone out into. So now this, um, why is this the counter? This is going to drop. I don't care if it's Keldeo. Uh, it's in range of an Earthquake at this point. I'm adamant. I don't care. Yeah, this thing's gone. Um, <laughs> as uh, Excadrill is already just cleaning up this game. Excadrill is such a threat. Ban Excadrill. No, I'm just kidding. Ban Scald. How about that? <laughs> uh, Scald is such a broken move. Uh, now he goes into Latios. I want to save this thing and most of its health. So I'm going to go straight into the Tornadus as he drops a Draco. And I died to the sand plus the burn. I forgot about the burn. Um, but I believe he's actually in range of an Adamant. Let's check the Calc. Let's check it real quick. Uh, as you can see here, I did a Calc real quick. By the way, Tornadus with this bulk um, does live with a quick attack from a Mega Pinsir. So you need to get up rocks if you want to kill off <laughs> Tornadoes. That's. I digress. Anyways, um, what was I gonna do? Yeah, uh, Life Orb, Excadrill. So, Uber Sandra. See, it used to be Uber. Adamant. That's correct. And let's go with Latios, because I just want to see if I can just end this game right now. I mean, it's pretty much over, anyways. Um, how much is Iron Head doing? A solid 77 to 91. As he left while I was calcing. So we are going to go ahead and pause the video as we look for another battle. I like this team a lot. Uh, it does get wins. It has its weaknesses, but I, I'm doing alright with it. So let's go ahead and get another battle. Okay, so we did get our next game here. And it's against a rain team. Rain teams can be rather scary, but that's why we have Ferrothorn, right? <laughs> Ferrothorn kind of really walls this guy's team. Um, and just looking at it, I mean, that's probably Rain Dance itself, right? Is that what you run? Anyways, I'm going to read lead Metacham. Uh, gives me a good matchup. I think I could just fake out here. Why do I want a high jump kick so badly? You went with high jump kicking. Um, I think he wants to save the Sash too. This is such a bad play. Don't do this. He did. Okay, so that's a double down to start off the game. That's rather bad. We're going to go with our Tornadus though. Um, as the Thunderous would be the only thing that beats it per se. Uh, I'm expecting the Polytoad to come out. Oh, that's... That sucks, because uh, Fake Out is rather nice, but at the same time, he didn't get up any hazards. I should have just faked out, honestly. I don't know. It's, it's such hard, hard, a hard decision, because nothing really wants to take, as he does go into the Thunderous. Uh, bolt Switch Incoming, correct? Does he have Grass Knot? You know what? This feels like Life Orb. I'm U-turning. Yeah, I thought so. Um, Ferrothorn should wall this, right? Oh my gosh. I don't even know. I'm going to go into on. I think it's the safest play here. As he goes straight for the HP Ice, that's fine. Uh, I want to scout for a Grass Knot. He's obviously not going for an electric move. I'm going to go straight back into my Tornadus. He might... Yes, there it is, the Grass Knot. I thought so. How should that U-turn do? A critical hit did 16... So it's doing a quick calc in my head. That means I'm doing around 10%, 11%. Um, so that means that a knockoff <clears throat> will be doing 35 times 4, 11, 40. It's going to be doing like 45. So it's just out of range here. I can't do... I have to U-turn here, um, which is fine. I'm going to go into Ferrothorn, as I know he's not going for um, Focus Blast. He goes for the Volt Switch. That's fine. Uh, I guess I could have gone Excadrill there. So whatever. See what he goes into. He goes into a Swampert, so I am expecting the Superpower, but I can kill this thing right now. You know what? I'm killing it right now. Superpower should not... S okay, that's fine. Uh, so like I said, Superpower will not be able to kill me from this range. Um, I'm actually expecting the switch now because he doesn't have a reason to stay in at this point. And I can get up a Spike. Yeah, let's get up a Spike. I figured the Tornadus was going to come in. Um... Let's protect, see what he wants to go for. He probably has Heat Wave. No, he has Hurricane. Uh, is this Life Orb? I mean, I can take a hit regardless. Hmm. Let's Leech Seed. I should be able to take this just fine. Yeah, I did. Uh, I was just kind of afraid of the confusion. As Ferrothorn, See, Ferrothorn puts in so much work. Um, I can protect here. I really can. But I don't think he stays in on this moment. Can we get up another spike? Can we power whip? Let's power whip. Go into Politoed. Oh, okay. This is fine as well. Uh, that did so much! 
Why did that just straight up kill? Power. See, okay, Ferrothorn actually has a decent amount of attack. It's like 90, maybe? Yeah, it's 94. Uh, and Power Whip, yeah, obviously. Why is this the play? I'm gonna go ahead and protect. I wanna see what he goes for. I'm confused. Why? Why is that the play? I'm just gonna go straight for the Leech Seed. Okay, that's the play. I see now. Um, that puts me in a little bit of a predicament, because he does have Taunt. Hmm. I want to go straight into my Tornadus. I do. I do, I do, I do. Anything, I think, I think Manaphy can beat this thing. Let's go into Tornadus. I'm, I think he's just going to Hurricane anyways. Yeah, he does go for the Hurricane. Hmm. I want to make a ridiculous play, go into Ferrothorn, and then double into Excadrill. He might be carrying superpower, though. I can't... Okay, this is going to be the play. I'm going to go Ferrothorn. As the Icy wins. Interesting. Now I'm going to go Manaphy. This is the play. This is definitely the play. Because now I can Ice Beam. He can go into Politoed or Kingdra or Swampert or whatever. It doesn't matter because I have Energy Ball. So that will be the play of choice here. Um... Yeah, many feet will be able to beat this thing. Why? Why did he go straight for it? Um, I think I'm just gonna ice beam. I'm expecting a taunt. These guys are speaking in a language that I don't understand. Uh, let's see what he does decide go, to go out into here. Probably the Politoed now. Set up the rain. Uh, I don't even care. As I could potentially kill this thing. Okay, I get a big, big fat. Okay, that didn't do much at all, actually. I guess it is only neutral damage of the energy ball, but I do like that damage. That was pretty good damage. And Spike is also very nice. Um... Trying to think what the opt optimal play is. I'm expecting a Draco... Well, you know what? Ferrothorn walls this thing. Let's just go into Ferrothorn. Draco is the play of choice. I did zero. Can't we just get up another Spike? I think the better play, though, is actually going straight back out into Manaphy. Because obviously Tornadus is going to come in here. I do need health. Let's lead seed. Uh, I expect the Tornadus to come out. That's fine. Um, now we're going to protect. I, yeah, I expect him to stay in. Uh, he probably just wants to fire off Hurricanes. This is fine by me. I'm just getting my health back. Does he taunt here? I'm trying to figure out exactly... What he might be doing... Might just go into Tornadus. Um, but I, w I should win this matchup because his team has been whittled down a little bit and that Spike's going to be putting pressure on him. Uh, Tornadus is really his only opportunity to win. Hmm. Double Protect? <laughs> Do I Double Protect? I can Spike. Let's Spike. As he does go for the hurricane, no, got the confusion. Please don't, don't please don't hit yourself. Yes, yes. <laughs> this was perfect. Um, actually expecting him to go ahead and go out into the swampert. I think. No, he just forfeits. Awesome, we got another win. Uh, we're at 13 minutes. We're gonna pause the video. We're gonna look for another match. This team is actually getting us a little bit of momentum. We're get, we're up to 1471. Uh, we'll go ahead and wait for the next battle. Okay, so we did get another game here. Um, man, if he's the play of choice, lead that chomp. Okay, he leads the Landorus. Honestly, just expecting a U-turn. Watch him go into that Azumarill. Can I tail glow? I'm tail glowing. I don't even care. He's going into it. Okay, just kidding. Uh, so this is probably a Sol Vest. Um, he's probably he's definitely going for the electric move. So we can go straight into our right our uh, Paladon. I mean, it walls this thing. If he doesn't go for an electric move, then he's a Dawn, which is not the play. Now we can go for Stealth Rock and put up some momentum on our side. He goes into the Gardevoir. Obviously a huge threat. Um, I'm going to go straight into Tornadus. I don't think I eat this thing up, honestly. <laughs> ah, that did so much. Oh, that did so much. You know what? I'm going to go into Ferrothorn, expecting the Garchomp to come out. No, he just went straight for it. Um, let's protect, let's scout, see if, if he has the HP fire, see if he has taunt, I want to see what he wants to go for. I expected him to stay in, he does have the HP fire, this puts us in such a weird spot. Um, 
You know what? He's going to stay in and go for the HP fire. I'm confident of that. I'm going to go into a Tornadus. I am confident of that. Oh, actually, he does switch out here. He goes into his Garchomp. Um, what's the play here? Let us... I think we just go Manaphy. This is fine. He, drew, he Swords Dance in front of me. That's scary. That is really scary. I mean, obviously... Oh my goodness. I don't think I love this. It's a freaking Garchomp. I think something has to be sacked at this moment. You know what, Tornadus is kind of expendable. I'm surprised he went straight for the Swords Dance. Uh, let's get this Hurricane. Uh, let's get this Confusion. Let's do it. Confuse, 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 confuse. No! Okay, so he does get the kill there. Um, But now we can just go Metacham, right? And get a kill. Can't we? I think it's literally our only play now. That was ballsy going for the Swords Dance. Oh my goodness. He's slack. Okay. Okay. That's fine. <laughs> scary, scary chomp. Uh, but props to you, she Pokemon. Um, <laughs> that's that's the name of this. Uh, props to you for not using Rocky Helmet. That explains why you didn't uh, bother. Why is this the counter? I can just go Ferrothorn. Um, if he belly drums. Oh my God. Why is that the play? I don't get that. I don't get why that's the play. This guy is just way too aggressive. Because now we can just Mega Champ. Mega Champ. We go Mega Champ, fake out, and bullet punch, and that will kill. So, whatever. I mean, that's his his vendetta. We could have stayed in, but I did not want to lose that. Okay, whatever. This guy makes, like, the most unnecessary plays. As I get a crit. <clears> hmm. <throat> you know, he's just going to Earthquake here. But you know what? Extra Drill just wins, doesn't he? Uh, we need to keep this. Uh, I want to go for Paladon, but that doesn't really do anything for me. I think I have to go Manaphy. Uh, it's probably just going to be an Earthquake anyways. He, what? These plays don't make any sense! <laughs> and he might be winning because of it. Uh, now he goes into Gardevoir. Um, doesn't, Me doesn't Metacham just win too? I guess he has Sucker Punch in the back, but I have a Pout on, don't I? <clears throat> well, this is the most expendable member. Don't really have a switch in. We're just going to go for the Scald. And now we can go Metacham. Fake out. He doesn't have anything to go into anyways. The Sharp. But then I can just go a Pout on. As he probably Swords Dances, knowing the way this guy plays. This <laughs> is ridiculous, really. You think he stays in? He's not staying in. He's not staying in, but I can't I can't afford to lose Metacham. Literally my only win con at this point. Well, I mean, obviously, extra drill. It's going to have to be some combination thereof. But this is definitely the better play to go for the fake out. I don't know if he's trying to make me think. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. But, I mean, either way, I will go to Pout on if he goes into the, the sharp. Because he doesn't, actually. He takes the clean 38%. Um, watch him go for H HP Ice. Oh my goodness. <gasps> wait, 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 wait. Does this kill? Yes! Yes! Got rid of the Gardevoir. Alright, so now we're in a really good situation. I did not, like, I figured HP Ice. There's no way he was going for an electric move there. The electric move just made no sense. Now he goes into the Landorus. Crit fake out did 44, so there's no way. There's no way we can kill this thing. He's earthquaking now. Um, because he has to. But the positive thing is we 1v1 this thing. So we're gonna first slack off. As he goes into Zoomerill. I don't get that play. Because now we can just earthquake. Um, Waterfall wouldn't be doing too much. He goes for the Aqua Jet? Hello? This guy catch AIDS? <laughs> um, now Hapowdon just wins, doesn't he? What's the play? This isn't a play. He's gonna drop. He's hoping for a flinch. No flinch. Yes! yes! So now Metacham just wins. 
So good game to my opponents. Made some rather unnecessary plays, in my opinion. Honest opinion. Um, I'm just going to slack off. That's, that does not kill. Nice. And we can slack off again. Uh, so we are going to pick up this win here. So another win for the team. Uh, big props to Gilga Vikings League. Gilga Vikings League. That's what I, I don't remember. This was a while ago when he passed me the team. Um, but we are up to 1485 in 20 minutes. We can get another game. So we're going to go ahead and pause the recording. Okay, so we did get another game here. It's against... I'm not even... Recognize this guy. Oh my goodness, tank growth is an issue, doesn't isn't he? Who does he lead with? Can we just lead Manaphy and get a kill? Is that unaware of Clef? Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. He's got a really stally team. Holy crap, it's stally. But if we can get rid of that Latias, that's his only form of hazard removal. So we're going to lead up out on. As he leads slow, bro. Probably expecting my Metacham. I mean, I really wanted to... I wanted to lead Manaphy. And this is his Mega as well. Unless it's Mega Latios. It could be. No one says it isn't. But we're going to take the Scald. Not bad. Um, you know what? I'm going to double into Manaphy. Because uh, it really is the best play here. He might just stay in Scald, but he goes into Heatran. Uh, that's not what I was... I, he, I was expecting him to stay in Scald, honestly. But now, I think we can get a kill. <laughs> Let's go ahead and Tail Glow. As he stays in, to go for Roar. But he gets the wrong mod. Um, that's fine. I'm going straight back out into Manaphy. I don't even care. Yeah, I didn't even care. But, yeah. Freaking Tangrowth. Oh my god, this is going to be a long match, I can already tell. He can't kill me with any one move. Mm. Also can't do anything to the Ferrothorn. I'm going to the Ferrothorn. Uh, this might be Assault Vested. That might have killed. I'm not sure. Let's get up a spike. Start putting on pressure. Um, he might not even defog for a spike. He goes straight into Clefable. It feels like Flamethrower, doesn't it? Would he go for that right now? But, um, we did go and see that, uh, okay, well, we beat this. We can go ahead and tail glow up. I could have gone straight into Excadrill. Like, that was what I was thinking about doing, but I'm like, he's definitely going for the, the flamethrower, right? He gets the drop. Of course he does. Um, we can just scald. He's gonna do nothing. He's gotta burn. That doesn't matter. Let's tail glow again. This guy's annoying. Now we gotta go Excadrill. Damn it. Alright, so that was really a poor play on my part. That's annoying. Whatever. Um, but now he goes into this. I can just go Earthquake. Expecting the Tangrowth or the Slowbro is the play. That did a clean amount. Holy crap. Um, he's switching into Tangrowth. So Iron Head. This guy's team is way too stally. I don't even want to play this. Hmm. Let's go into Pharaoh and get another spike up. <sighs> Maybe that was a Salt Vested Slowbro, because it's feeling like a, a Mega Latios, to be honest. So maybe it doesn't have Defog. I mean, Defog doesn't make any sense in this on. Like, if he didn't have Defog, this doesn't make any sense. That's what I'm saying. Let's Leech Feed now as he switches out. Yep. There is the Latios, so Defog is probably incoming. And I'm just going to set up Spikes. <laughs> because I don't lose. Yeah, let's keep let's keep setting up Spikes. Because I keep expecting the Defog. Okay, and so he goes into the Tornadus. Um, this feels like a Heat Wave, so I'm just going to Protect. See what he goes for. He does go for the heat wave. Latias has to have recover, right? You know, I live a heat wave. I'm leech seeding. Oh my gosh. You can't just crit hurricanes. This is his sweeper. He has um he has a life orb. I did a lot. Um let's just leech seed again. Expecting the switch out. Nice. 
Got that prediction right. Um, expecting him to actually... You know what? We need to put some pressure on. We're going to go into Medicham and get a fake out off. This is a clean 35. Not bad. Stays in, right? Can we, can we win this? Um... Think of the best play. I think he's U-turning. Let's high jump kick. <gasps> he missed. Come on, come on, lay, 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 lay. Yes. Okay. So a little bit of hacks in our favor there. Uh, obviously that hurricane would have killed. Um, but I was going off. Uh, okay. Fine. Whatever. Leave, please. Please leave. Um. I don't even think this this thing kills. Be the way I'm going, Ferrothorn. Fine by me. <laughs> Honestly, if he was smart, he'd go into Tangrowth here. That's fine. I'm gonna spike. Nice. I'm expecting the rocks. You know, either way, I'm going to meta champ. I gotta get another kill. I get, I get tired of this kind of stuff. It's so boring. We're playing stall. Okay. So he decides to sack off the Latias. That's fine. That is fine by me. Because now I can stack hazards with Ferrothorn. <laughs> like, that's that's what I was hoping to do the whole time. Um, he goes into this stupid, stupid monster. Let's go into Paladon as he Moonblasts. Gets a crit and a special attack drop. Fuck you! This guy is just a turd and a half. Do I just whirlwind here? Now I'm gonna rock. Let's rock. Let's rock! Nice, 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 not bad. Um, I wanted to whirlwind, but this is fine as well. You know, I'm expecting like an HP fire or something, but either way, I'm gonna sack off Manaphy at this point. Yep, there is the HP fire. That's exactly what I thought was gonna happen. Reading this guy like a fiddle. But I think Metacham can win this. Mega Slowbro, though. Probably spit out Mega Slowbro. I don't know. It just... Earthquake did so much to it. I think that's... Well, combination of... Combination of these three monsters, um, Tornadus, Extra Drone, Medicham, should be able to deal with Slowbro, I think. Let's go for the Ice Beam. That's fine. Um, now we can go in the Medicham and get a kill. Right? We're just gonna go straight for the High Jump Kick. It kills everything. I'm pretty sure. Uh, I'm not afraid of anything on his team, honestly. So, solely teams like this, you just gotta whittle them down. Oh my goodness. <laughs> there was a moment, like, earlier in, the, in, in this game, I was just really, really contemplating just forfeit. Because <laughs> this is not fun. <laughs> it's not fun trying to break through teams. Got a little bit of luck on our sides with that Hurricane Miss. Okay. Anyways, now we go into our Tornadus, which probably should have been the play from the beginning. Now we're going to knock off. I'm um, expecting the Heatran to come out. That's so annoying. You know what? U-turn probably kills, doesn't it? Let's U-turn. It's better. Now we go extra drill and click Earthquake. Get a kill. Right? That's so annoying. <sighs> Whatever. What are you going to do? I guess maybe, um... No, we just click Earthquake. There's no reason to go for anything else. Nice. Nice. Does the X-Girl just win? Hmm. Be kind of disappointing if we lost this. How much did Earthquake do last time? Let's find this. Did 57% to this thing. Hmm. Can I kill? You know, I need this x drill 100%. So we gotta go Torn. This is probably gonna Mega. No, he went straight into Tangrowth. Trying to make plays. 
Um, obviously, that made a little bit of sense just because he got his health back. Um, but now we can knock off. That did zero. It's Iron Head. What the hell? I'm U turning. Um, as he can switch out, obviously. But I'm gonna keep up momentum on my side, and I'm gonna get up more layers if if I need to. Okay, so that's fine. Now we go with a pout on. Um, that's gotta be his mega, right? He hasn't megaed yet, but uh, that's probably just because he wants the regenerator. We're war no 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 we're 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 whirlwinding this thing. <sighs> now we're gonna go Ferrothorn. Get straight back in the clefable. Interesting. Hmm. I'm trying to think of the series of plays that wins me this. I'm a spike. He obviously doesn't have a fire move. I'm a spike again. Can't let uh, Slowbro keep getting this regenerator BS. Because then uh, Excadrill can just win. Yep, that's the play. That's that's what we're going to do. Special attack drop. That's cute. Hmm. Okay, we just got a sack. We're going to go Torn. We're going to U-turn. Sack a Pout on. And then hopefully kill with Excad. Actually, that did zero. So <sighs> We have to Iron Head. Don't have a choice. His only play is to go slow, bro. Or maybe somehow live this. He doesn't live this. This is the 50-50. This is what it comes down to. Um, I'm cool with that. Get it right. Nice. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Um, what's he going to come in on? A solid... Oh my gosh, that did so much. Got Earthquake. Let's see the Mega. There it is. Does this kill? No! Okay. Um... This thing is such a stupid mon. Uh, we gotta stay in. I want a rapid spin. That's so dumb. Earthquake crit doesn't even kill from here. A little bit of 4 HP. I guess if we would have had more spikes up earlier, I guess we would have won this. Hmm. I wanna go for the Iron Head flinch. Yep, that's my play. Flinch, 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 flinch. Flinch. Okay. We can't all have nice things. So now we hurricane and confuse this thing. Please, please confuse. Please confuse. Yes, yes, hit yourself, hit yourself. Yes, yes, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. No, come on. This is stupid. Come on. Come on. Hit yourself. Yes. One more. One more hit. Hit yourself one more time. No, come on. This is so dumb. I hate slow, bro. I hate it so much. I hate it so much. I hate it so much. I hate it so fucking much. <sighs> Honestly, I'm not even gonna give him the, uh... Yeah, whatever. It's so bad. Um, anyways, we got one more game here. Um, against Honchkrow's Wrath, I don't want to end on a loss. We're going to lead with Metacham, because it destroys this guy's team. As he leads with probably his Rocker. I don't think we lose anything by faking out, though. No? Okay, whatever. Um, this is a U-turn coming, right? No way Iron Head's turn one. What's he going for? This feels like Scarf. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Get blown away. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> um, so he tried to trick, obviously. Uh, now something's gonna die. Because <laughs> Landers is not gonna live. Actually, did he did okay against that. Um, does this kill? I'm trying to think. It doesn't, but I want to get damage off on this thing. That wasn't even close. Nice! <laughs> Let's just get the solid, like, destroy this guy already. Dude, Honchkrow's a, a, a monster as he goes into it, right? No. Okay, so he sacks off his Draji. That's fine. Actually, he didn't sack it off, did he? 
Hmm. Bullet punch does not kill. Because fake out did eight. And we're at half attack. Well, actually, it's a roll, right? Let's go Pharaoh. I think he's just sacking anyways. I think he's gonna go for the Iron Head. No, he went for the Healing Wish. Whatever. I don't care. That's fine. That's fine. I don't care. I'm just gonna set up hazards, right? And now we Leech Seed. His best play would be go going into Sceptile. Wow. Okay. <sighs> That's annoying. That did 47? Do we see an item? He has lefties. It's like max attack lefties. Let's Leech Seed. I don't think he's staying in. He stays in. Okay, so now he's leaving. Now let's protect. I definitely need to get some health back um, on this Ferrothorn. Ferrothorn will be important for this game, I'm feeling. Um, yeah, he does stay in. He really wants to kill this Ferrothorn off. Which is fine. <laughs> um, let's go to Horn. I'm feeling like that's safe. I'm feeling like it's a safe move. Yep, it was. Call me the Lord. Can we U-turn? Let's U-turn. He might stay in to go for the Stone Edge, but either way, I'm U-turning. Okay, that's fine. We're gonna go into Pharaoh and get more health back. Okay, that does so much. It's like some. I don't. I don't get it. That's just way too much damage. I think. Whatever. Um, now he goes to the Sceptile, the monster. But I think Torn is completely fine here. Uh, we can't protect. He probably is going to set up a substitute, to be honest. This thing is a monster. He actually went for, straight for the HP fire. Um, we can U-turn. I don't think he wants to take damage on this thing. And we need to get health back either way. This is fine. That's the counter. <coughs> okay, so... Why'd he go into Latias? Is he going to defog for me? He's going to get rid of the rocks? Like, that makes no sense. Why is, why is that the play? Spiking a heat wave, maybe? Even though that does neutral? So, Metacham will 2-hit KO this. With a fake out and bullet punch. That's what we're going to do. That's what we're going to do. If Lando comes in, then he's just taking more damage, which is what we need. Um, it's kind of... A, actually, it's not a 2-hit KO. What the heck? This Latias is so damn bulky. You know, honestly, we can just go straight back out into Torn and you turn again. Oh my. He's one of these types. I almost went into Ferrothorn, but this guy. Oh my gosh. I just got super upset at this guy for doing this garbage. You're trash, kid. I'm knocking off because I don't want him roosting. I do not want him roosting. It's fine. But now we can get a kill. Um. That Sceptile is kind of an issue. You know what, between Metacham and uh, Excadrill, I'm not too worried about it. He does go into Lando. Now he can just freely Earthquake, can he? Why does he do so much damage? It's like max attack. This thing's stupid. Let's just go Ferrothorn. Yep, as he does go for that. Sweet, sweet move. But now Manaphy just wins, doesn't it? We're gonna Ice Beam. Sceptile is obviously the only issue. But he doesn't have a counter for this. If we get rid of the Sceptile, why does he outspeed? That's crazy. How did he... Yeah, that's that's crazy that he just outsped us. He's like the most optimal... I don't even get that. Hmm. We 
We unfortunately do need this for the Zoomerl, so we have to go up out on here and probably sack. He goes for the Gay Drain. It's like all of his health back. Probably just gonna go for it again, right? I imagine that is the play. Yep. Now we go Excadrill and get a kill, right? Hopefully this does kill Sceptile. I mean, Megas honestly have a lot of bulk. There is that play. I had a feeling that was coming. I think it was Zoomer. He just wins because he gets Sceptile. We have to Earthquake. Hopefully he goes for Waterfall. Go for Waterfall. <gasps> he did, but he didn't die. Wait, did he belly? Nice, okay. But this just, uh, this... How much is Fake Out and Bullet Punch doing to a uh, Honchcrow? Not enough, probably. Ugh. Why couldn't he have just died there? Mm. We only need Mana Fee for this Azumarill, so we gotta go there now. The Aqua Jet's probably going to be a 2 hit KO. I, I mean, I guess it is. <laughs> that could have been a roll. Jeez. So he just had like the perfect counter team or something. This is stupid. <sighs> now we can just sack this thing. And Sceptile just wins, right? This just played out perfectly for him. So... You have to high jump kick, but it, it doesn't matter. So this is going to be a game... Wow, he lived. You know what, that's, that's our luck today. Uh, so, <laughs> we're going to go ahead and call that a game. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, this was... A normal laddering series. This was a, good, a, a fun team, but honestly, like when you get hacks like that, like it's it's honestly the most annoying team in the world. Um, that's why I have a lot of losses because I was getting I ran into a guy with a Machamp, a scarf Machamp. So that should just I'm, I'm gonna leave it at that. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, this should be going up today, uh, and I'll just see you guys next time.